Yo, what's going on, Nuggets Nation? Welcome back to the channel. Um, so, Nuggets get a bounce back win tonight, uh, beating the Houston Rockets 129 to 116. Uh, sorry that I didn't make a uh, video recap on the game last night when the Golden State Warriors completely beat the brakes off of us, but I didn't make a video because I was pissed and I didn't want to come on here. Um, be honest, I just flat out was too lazy to make a video last night. <laughs> so, um, but I give the Warriors credit. They, uh, you know, took care of business. They definitely need to win as many games as they can. I mean, they probably don't want to be in a play-in game. So, uh, they, I know they definitely want to win as much as they can, see if they can move up or not. But, you know, they took care of business, and they, you know, played really good against us. So, give them credit where credit's due. They deserved to beat us last night. But that don't matter anymore. Because the Nuggets bounced back tonight, beat the Rockets, which they should have won this game. Um... Big story in my eyes last night was uh, Will Barton got injured, like, first, like, minute of the game. Um, just, uh, I'm glad we're done playing in Oracle because our all our players keep getting hurt when we play there. I don't know. Oracle's cursed for the Nuggets. So, thank God we do not play at the stadium anymore this season. Um, it's kind of ironic because Murray tears his ACL, uh, last minute of the fourth quarter and then Barton pulls a ham, pulls his hammy <laughs> opening minute next time we go to Oracle. So, uh, I don't know if it's a coincidence or not, but, um, thank God we're not going back to that stadium. Now for Will Barton, um, hopefully he's going to be healthy Come playoff time, I think the Nuggets can definitely stay afloat, even without them. Because um, tonight, P.J. Dozier showed out. Um, he did amazing. It was great to see. He had 23 points starting. Uh, I think his first career start. And he balled out. Um, I love P.J. Dozier's size. I think he's definitely a great guard. And I'm glad he came in tonight and... Uh, you know, play how he did, because if Barton's going to be out, he's going to have to play like that, especially against uh, a lot of the good teams that we still have left on the schedule. <clears throat> but another big story tonight, Michael Porter Jr., steal of the draft, shows out, shows up, balls out. Um, that's exactly what we need him to do if we're going to have a chance in the playoffs. Um but yeah, for Michael Porter, he's basically he's basically got to grow up now, and uh, <laughs> I think he did tonight. To be honest, he had thirty nine points, um, eight for twelve from three. I mean, that was just incredible. Um, but yeah, <laughs> that was a great performance for Michael Porter Jr. And hopefully, you can keep that up. Um, I definitely love Michael Porter Jr.'s game. Thought he was a great player in college. I'm, I'm sh still shocked that he fell to Denver. I'm glad they kept him out that season, get him all healthy, ready, because now he's he's balling now. So, yeah, it's definitely exciting having that kind of player on your team. Um, crazy that he fell to us, but thankful for all the teams that passed on him. <laughs> um. With that being said, uh, I think uh, Bench did all right tonight. Um, Aaron Gordon didn't really do much. Neither did uh, Faku. I mean, he had 13 assists, though. So I shouldn't say he didn't do much. Um, but, you know, Gordon did what he did. Um, he didn't go crazy. He only had seven points. Um, yeah, Faku, 13 assists. Career night for him. And uh, Nikola Jokic, he almost had a triple-double. He had 24 points, 12 assists, and 8 rebounds. So, good performance for uh, the Joker. But, um, all in all, it was a great win. Great way to bounce back in the Lakers' loss. So, Nuggets are pretty, looking pretty in the four seed. Um, but, 
I don't know, guys. We still got a lot of basketball left. I think like 13 games, that's that's a lot to me. I think a lot can still happen. So we'll uh, see what happens, man. Um, I think the Nuggets have to stay in the fourth seed, though. They have to have home court if they're going to have a slight chance at even winning a round without Jamal Murray. But who knows? Barton might not be available either. So we'll see what happens. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hit the like button. Subscribe if you're new. Other than that, stay safe. Be good. Let's go Nuggets, man. Let's go. Great win tonight. Let's keep it up. I think we have the Grizzlies on Monday. So we'll see what happens. Anyway, stay safe. Be good. See you guys in the next one. Peace.